live work. It's on. How's it, guys? How's it going? We'll wait for a few people to hop on. I've got my friend Peter here with me. <laughs> How's it? We just finished up a CrossFit session. Uh, we're making a quick coffee. And um, then we're going to ask Peter a few questions, get into conversation with Peter. Are you live as well? <laughs> so, um, yeah, just keep on building the audience and we'll be with you guys now. Well, um, yeah. Welcome to those guys who have hopped on. Um, hope you guys enjoyed your Friday. And it's obviously weekend, probably excited for the weekend. Uh, we're pretty excited. We have a training for our team this weekend, tomorrow in Centurion. That's the reason why Peter's here. Mm. Um, He's probably going to bring us some good stuff for this weekend. So, Peter, how's about you tell everybody about our CrossFit session? You know what, Gary? Yeah, you right said now. I hope you guys are looking forward to the weekend. But you know what? I believe that people need to look forward to every single day in their lives. That's true. How about creating a life of not only living for weekends, yeah. but living for every day? That's you true. know, once you're in your passion and in your purpose, every day is like a weekend. Amen. And uh, that's what we're all about, is helping people to live seven days a week, 365, Come on. as it is, as if it is, weekend. That's right. Um, no, Kaza, it was, uh, can you just put for a bit more? Gary, and, Gary, um, more They say, um, with that true plenish, no sugar with it. No sugar, that's, oh, by the <laughs> way, this is yeah, raw yeah. honey. This is raw honey. But Gary's got a, I've got a, raw I've honey. a challenge with Gary, because he makes me, he makes coffee so... He thinks my surname is low, so he makes it flow. Right. Yeah? <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, yeah, no, look, guys, the CrossFit was very, very tough. It was hard, it was good, but I enjoyed it. I've got a few Ks to lose. That's 8 to 10 you. Ks. I picked up a few, almost I picked up a few kilometers, but that as well. But I picked up a few Ks uh, the first three months. So, so good for you. Yeah, I've got already. I've took it already. I'll give you double. Huh? I'll give you double. <laughs> <laughs> so we're looking forward to the to, to the transformation uh, 90 days. Where we're going to help people to transform their lives, spirit, soul, and body. Yeah. And everything starts with the body because if you're in an unhealthy body, you don't really you can't focus, you can't do anything. So uh, yeah. Is that better? I started already. Is that better? Fine. Okay, let's see if we can take this outside. Um, Ask Peter some questions. See if we can bring you guys some value, some good value, um, on this Friday before you go into the weekend. Big thank you to Shamaine, who's behind the camera, doing a great job as always. Thank you so much, Shamaine. That's a pleasure, guys. You're amazing. Shamaine, um, I think you must just learn your hobby to make coffee, eh? Because man, <laughs> teach, 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 teach. That's right. Just hold on. <laughs> Gary. Yes. Just stop. Right. Right. <laughs> That's it. Sweet. So, um, yeah, guys, if you're in the Pretoria region um, and you're keen to find out more about what we're doing, um, we have a training tomorrow uh, at the Pretty Hotel in Centurion. So that's going to be fired up. Um, we're going to be explaining a bit on our business that we're involved with um, and a few other things. So, um, yeah, we'll wait for Peter to finish up with his coffee. Um, we'll take it outside, ask him a few questions. Um, just on his journey, obviously for those of you guys who don't know Peter, most of you guys on my Facebook should know Peter, I believe. Um, but Peter was a professional rugby player as well. For how many years did you play, Peter? Um, well, I started playing professional when I was in, when I was 17 and 79. That's when I signed my first professional contract. So that's what almost 10 years. Uh, but it's eight, eight to 10 years. 10 years, and at the Stormers um, throughout your whole journey, right? Yeah. Stormers in Western Province. Um, Probably about just over 50 caps for the Stormers, and uh, that's actually where I met Peter. Was when we were uh, played rugby together. I just broke through. Um, I was a youngster. I remembered my, my first training. Um, I stepped Peter. <laughs> His legs went all wobbly, and, and I'm still um, struggling with a knee. I've still got a knee problem today. <laughs> but I think that's not because of the stepping. I think that's because of the extra weight I'm carrying. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm just kidding, I'm just kidding, um, but anyways, that's why I met Peter, and um, you know, Peter's been a part of our lives now for the past, I'd say, seven, eight years, we've been building a business together for five years, he as you can see, seven or eight years, <laughs> it's been tough, it's been rough, we've, <laughs> given, we've given him some hard times, but um, yeah, Peter's the one who introduced me to network marketing, he introduced us to the business that we're building right now, um, he's taught us everything that we know, and uh, we're very thankful for you in Solani, Peter. Um, yeah, you guys have really mentored us uh, to a point where, you know, we 
are really passionate about what we're doing. Yeah. And um, yeah, we're very thankful for that. So well, you're phenomenal leaders now, and you are mentoring a lot of, of thousands of other people. Come on, that's good. So take yeah. this outside. Cool, yeah. Sweet. Doesn't matter. So, um, but I think the Ooh. first thing, that's fine, that's fine. the first thing that I think a lot of people would love to hear, and I find this very inspiring, um, a lot of people know your story in our business and, and in the team, but, um, you know, just maybe share on how you got involved in network marketing and um, a bit on your story, um, you know, obviously playing rugby, losing your contract mm. and, you know, everything that led up to where you are right now. Well, it's, you know what, someone just, a great friend of mine, Jake Picosta, we used to play rugby together. And, uh, um, you know, he just came to, well, I actually came to him, we were, we were in Pretoria. And uh, um, I said to him, listen, yeah, I think I need to start on this, you know, you, you guys have this stuff that's bring good to recovery, lose, mu uh, builds muscle mass and loses fat and stuff like that. And I said, I would like to chat to you. So, uh, JP Costa just shared this great business opportunity with me. Um, I got started, knew nothing about this industry, knew no or this profession, knew nothing about business. I was only used to playing rugby, kicking balls, catching balls, diving with my head into the rocks in the malls. Getting stepped by me. Getting stepped by you. <laughs> and uh, um, yeah, I just started off and, uh, you know, at six months, um, uh, you know, building this business part time, I started part time, but then I lost my income. Uh, um, I, I, I didn't have any plan B's, but my plan B were basically building my business and uh, um, that's why I decided after six months uh, losing my income my wife was uh, heading to be pregnant um, I just decided you know what I will p take a, a pay cut uh, but I'm gonna do this full-time because uh, the, the the network marketing profession is uh, it, it just changed our lives and I saw how many other people's lives are being changed it absolutely um, I, as, as, as a human I just grew so much you know learning entrepreneurship learning about leadership, building family, meeting phenomenal people like you guys and uh, my sister sitting there behind Champagne. Mm -hmm. And uh, I just decided, you know what, I want to wake up every morning deciding I want to wake up, when I want to wake up, where I want to wake up. I want to determine my income. Yeah. Started building, never went back to rugby, and now we are bringing hope to the world. Awesome. I, I most definitely want to help other rugby players as well, or professional sports people, because mm -hmm. I know that it's tough for them. and um, Especially life after sport. Absolutely, and this is the vehicle that we can help millions of people with. Yeah. So something you mentioned there, um, you know, I think there are a lot of people, you mentioned going full-time really quickly in network marketing, mm -hmm. you know, but mm -hmm. as, we, as we both know, it's such a good part-time opportunity and you mentioned not having a plan B and how important is it these days do you think for people to have a plan B Absolutely. and you know how ideal is this vehicle of network marketing to build that plan B you know because we there's so much uncertainty mm. in the world mm. uh, maybe share a bit about that because you experienced mm. it in such mm. a you know uh, amazing way mm. I think that the whole thing of having a plan B 99% of people now listening you would think plan B money but I think what draws money is the value and the person that you become because you become bigger. You, know, you, you, you start understanding that if the economy is all about adding value to people's lives and then the money just automatically comes. So most definitely network marketing is all about building something part-time. But as you start a network marketing business, the, the amazing thing of that is you, you actually become more valuable. Mm -hmm. I mean, I mean... I, I, I'm, I'm seeing people that still working full time and part time doing this, but I mean they get they getting pay rises in their jobs. They moving from 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 being employed to becoming managers and directors. So you know what? Most definitely, if you are thinking, um, you know what? For me, it was very simple. Um, just having one stream of income is just plain dumb. I mean, it's just <laughs> stupid. I mean. If you've got an opportunity like network marketing that you can part-time build something after hours, you know, yeah. from 8 to 5 you make a living, after 5 you make a fortune, and you see the benefits with network marketing, I mean, I mean, how do you explain that? Uh, yeah. You know, it's, it's just a matter of where, where do I get started? Yeah. You know? So, yeah. That's awesome. And I see Belle, <coughs> she's joined us. Little kitty. Our long clock. <laughs> Every single <coughs> morning. Um, yeah, Peter, that's great that you shared that. I think also... A good thing about our vehicle is the low barrier to entry. 
Mm -hmm. um, you know, it doesn't cost you millions of, of, of dollars or rands to get involved, yeah. which is why a lot of people look to network marketing. But you know, I think the industry has also evolved so much. You yeah. know, 50 years ago, 70 years ago, when people think network marketing, they think like, oh, sales, I've got, I've got a bunch of products in my boot, I've got a sticker <laughs> on my car, like I'm just driving around delivering things to people, <laughs> filling in forms. And, um, you know, how have, have things like, I mean, just like Facebook Live, the fact that we can get together now on a Friday evening and, you know, add value to people's lives on Facebook. Um, how has social media evolved and changed the game? Um, things like the internet, you know, in this direct selling model that we're involved with, you know. Mm -hmm. Maybe share a bit about that because I know you're very active as well on social yeah. media. Um, you know, and you're also being, doing a great job with the Get Loaded world, bringing value and content to people mm -hmm. on a weekly basis. Oh, well, Gary, you know what I think? Uh, not I think I know. But first and foremost, the biggest myth out there to our friends and to our family and to our to the Gary van Aswegen.com world, the Get Loaded world, the Get van Aswegen, the Get van Aswegen, <laughs> unleash your purpose yeah. world, is that you are selling every single day of your life. I mean, if you married or you've got a girlfriend, man, you sold yourself on her. She had to sell herself. You know, if you thinking of your kids, you have to sell your kids every single day of your life. I mean, you love a great restaurant and then you talk about it and then you sell the restaurant to people. So. The amazing thing of what's happening nowadays in the world is that everything is evolving. You know what? Steve Jobs made an amazing statement. He said it is the learners that will inherit the earth. While the people that's learned the past tense, they will be beautifully equipped for a world that no longer exists. Sure. So if you're in business right now and your business is not online and you're not utilizing Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, WhatsApp, uh, what, are, what else is there? Snapchat. Snapchat, Instagram. You know what, you know, you're going to be beautifully equipped, you're going to be beautifully equipped for a world that no longer exists. So, so a lot of people run out of business and they don't understand why. And it's purely just because they haven't evolved. And, and, and network marketing, again, is such an amazing model because you are always ahead of the trend, always ahead of what's coming. Because network marketing companies are always, just, you know, that's just how it is. They, they... Evolving. They're evolving continually and, and, and it's always new things happening and new people you're meeting and new products that can be distributed, ways of distributing it. So, uh, yeah. But another thing that I think is very important is, um, and we chat about this often, is people finding their purpose and really driving their passion. You know, And that's something that our team is really passionate about, yeah. is helping people to become excited about life again. You know? Tough, t times are tough, um, circumstances are tough for a lot of people, a lot of people said the economy is tough and, you know, people are looking for a way out, people are looking for, you know, significance yeah. and maybe share about, you know, just the vision of our team as well, I mean, because this is yeah. coming from the top down, I mean, you guys, you and JP are obviously leading this vision, leading this um, this, this team of ours and establishing the yeah. culture that we have right now, you know, so maybe share a bit about that on, on, on you know, how are we bringing hope to people, passion back yeah. to people and, and that excitement in their lives again, you know? Yeah. Well, I think first and foremost, I think uh, one thing that we don't teach and that is go and look for a job. Uh, you know, the biggest mistake people are doing is they are looking for a job instead of creating a job. So people say the economy is tough and they need this and they need that, but it's because they are continually giving themselves, I call it, you give your power to other people to do with you what they want to do with you instead of creating your own future, instead of really, uh, because we all know that, you know, and, and, and I understand, you know, there's nothing bad with getting a job, but stop getting a job and start creating jobs for yep. people. Yep. And uh, you know what, so what you're saying is a job could be a short-term solution, absolutely. But, but in the long run, absolutely. if you're not fulfilled in your job, that's you're going to run on a treadmill that's it. like your whole life. That's it. You yeah. know what, I, I believe that every single human being, because they were created by God, and God is a kind of an entrepreneur because He creates. That's you know, the, the Greek or the, the Hebrew meaning for work is not go look for a job, it means become. So when you become, everyone's got a gift, everyone on Facebook, everyone on the social, you've got a gift, you've got a purpose. You've got something that the world needs, but then you take that something and you you just waste it. It's like putting your talent, you know, on the remote yeah. So, you know what? What we stand for is really to take people from the Egypt, Egypt mental, mentality onto the promised land. Help people to create their own, you know, create their own promised land. And we really just want, want to see a generation because we're sitting in the midst of a 
explosion, a revolution of entrepreneurs being birthed. You know, um, I've been reading a great book on this uh, about Paul and Paul's speaking about you know the next ten years, how many millionaires, 10, 10 million new millionaires will be birthed. Now, now before you go on, Paul Zane, Paul Zane, for those of you guys who don't know, is a world-renowned economist. Um, you know, who's predicted so many trends in the future, uh, in the past. He's actually consulted for, I think, two or three American presidents. Um, so that's that's who Peter's speaking about right now. So a very influential guy. Yeah. So we 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 want to teach people and help people and guide people to to take ownership of their own lives and really create their own wealth and create their own business and create their own network marketing business and add more value to themselves because as they grow, it's like a tree. You grow, and then as you become bigger and bigger and bigger, it's like these little branches, and, and that is exactly how it will happen, you know. You become this big tree where people can come and sit underneath, and the sun represents the sting of life, but when you're under the tree and under these branches, you get protected. And we want to teach people to become their own trees. Sure. So they can go out there and, and you know, do what they're supposed to do. Pretty cool analogy. Mm, thanks. You always have such a great <laughs> way of making things so simple. <laughs> well, so that's awesome. Cool, man. So, yeah, guys, I think, um, how long have we been going, Shemaine? Can you see that? Mm -mm. Probably a bit too long. It's good. But it's fine. It's um, good information. It's been good information. I think there are a lot of you guys, if you find a good value from this, hit us with a few likes. Um, feel free to share your opinions as well. You know, I mean, that's what, that's what we do every single day is we share our art with people, you know, and, and we've been wrong so many times, I mean, in the <laughs> past, uh, you and we can laugh about it yeah. now, you know, because I think both of us are, like, we have this sort of, like, characteristic of maybe not thinking before we speak often, <laughs> you know, so we get so excited about something, so passionate about something, and then we just run with it, you know? I'm not like that. Actually. Oh, you're not like that, of course you are. <laughs> like, I wonder what, I don't learn it from you, either. Um, but, uh... It, it's a bad thing, but at the same time, I think it's a good thing, you know, because you, you learn to take action, you get into motion, and, you know, motion produces emotion, yeah. as Tony Robbins explains it. Um, so, maybe just the last message for everybody watching, Peter, I don't know, whatever's on your mind, just feel free to let, let loose, let rip. Yeah, well, Gary, I think the most important thing, you were touching on that, I don't know, I don't know where, where people are, but you know what, just, just do something, just get started with something, just, whatever, if you want to, if you want to become a painter, just, just start painting, if you want to, become, uh, you know, make chairs or become a, a carpenter or become a network marketer or become an entrepreneur, put a plan in place. Your plan is not necessarily going to succeed, but, but at least you are in motion. And that's exactly what you decided. You decided 10 minutes ago, man, I'm going to do a Facebook Live. I want to feel, it's Friday night, people are partying, but you decided, man, I need to add some value to, to my people, to my friends, to my family on, on Facebook. So j just get busy, just get busy with the right, with the things. And uh, a lot of people say, you know, Peter, but how do I know it's the right thing? Well, you do know. The only reason you don't know it's because some people are telling you you shouldn't do this, you must do this. Because, but, but that's rubbish. I mean, that's just that's just nonsense. You know, you know, you know exactly what you want to do. Don't follow society. Don't look at society and say, you know, society says I must go and look for a job, and then after forty years I'm going to be broke. No, 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 no. Look, be different. You know, if you look at ninety-five percent of people, if they Uh, yeah, man, um, we here, yeah, I mean, you guys, like Gary, you guys are doing an amazing and a phenomenal job. You guys are changing people's lives on a daily basis. Just keep on doing what you do. You are absolutely, you, you and Charmaine sitting behind the camera there. As a couple, you, you're so you're authentic, you're honest, you're passionate. You're actually going to change your generation. And once we change our generation, you know, the few, you see, our job, our purpose in life, I believe, is just to leave our generation and the generation that we're going to help and we're going to lead like our kids is, is leave them with, with, with something special that they can take into the next millennium, you know, whatever you want to call it. So uh, you guys keep on doing what you're doing because, uh, man, I love you guys. You're like my brother and you're my sister and uh, we're, going to, we're going to do something significant. And for everyone out there, we are together going to pull together and we're going to do something that's never been done. Yep. You know what? Two is better than one. But imagine yourself a thousand, ten thousand, a million people together. Click of a button, we can communicate, and then we can help people become entrepreneurs and change the business world completely. Awesome. Thanks so much, Peter. So, yeah. And um, yeah, thanks for spending the weekend with us. We are definitely, our cups are going to be so full after this weekend, I believe. Um, we'll probably have some late night chats, as mm. usual. Mm. Get the coffee going. 
So um, thank you for your time. And guys, I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you found value from it. And um, if you did, like I mentioned, share some comments, share your opinion, hit a few like buttons, share it with a couple of friends. And um, ultimately, we'll see you guys around on Facebook. So have a great weekend. See you in Vegas. Oh, of course. See you in Vegas. For those of you guys who are going to be in Vegas, um, the team, all our international speakers, um, part of our company. See you guys in Vegas in April. We're looking forward to that. And, and, and we're going to be shooting some cool videos in Vegas as well, guys. So you guys can... Um, can follow us and keep track. Um, we'll bring you some good value there as well. Absolutely free. So have a great weekend, guys. See you.